read because I didn't. I've never done it before. Um, <clears throat> again, I'm a 45 year resident of Rochester, so I've been dealt with those. Um, you don't represent anything, again, uh, that dealt with those type of offer. Uh, Kim Norton, I challenge you to a public um, discourse on COVID. <clears throat> I have all the stuff on my phone. I just, I, I can't read through it all. So we had roughly 195, 198 COVID deaths in Olmstead County as a whole, of, as of the last time I spoke. Um, that's out of 49,000 positive tests. Mind you, that's a 97% false positive rate on those tests per the inventor of the test. Um, so we've carried on this lie for two years, and I don't know if we have to uh, pull your surety bonds. I don't know if we have to um, sue you or criminally, civilly. I don't know what to do, but you don't represent us any longer. Mm. None of you do. We've all done the same thing. You all perpetuated the lie for two years. You ruined 7,700 jobs, not to mention people that have had to close businesses, and you've ruined families. You brought our kids down to a 20 year low in, in learning, and you two have training in small adult or small child education. And you know that most of their learning comes from facial expressions. They're learning to enunciate, right? How is a deaf person, Kim, supposed to, to do that? I have a deaf nephew, not to mention that he's developmentally and physically delayed, you know? Uh, like, good thing he doesn't know that you guys are full of lies. So, I don't know what we're gonna do. I'm trying to, again, this goes back to my dad, Kim. You know my dad. Your shot killed my dad. Your shot killed my dad. Know that. That's crimes against humanity. Nuremberg, 75 years, last month. Seeing no one, uh, 